today I'm going to teach you how to automatically download YouTube videos to your computer. So if there are certain tags that you want to have all of the videos to, like maybe a video game, maybe a tip or something like that, you can have it every time one is added, download to your computer, or you can have every video by a user automatically download to your computer. So let's say that you want every video that I made, but you you don't use YouTube that much, and you want to view it offline on your computer or something like that. This would be great for that. So I'll teach first. Uh, you're gonna have to learn what an RSS feed is. So I'll briefly go over that. And you'll be learning about YouTube RSS feeds. So go to youtube.com slash RSS LS. And it briefly explains what RSS feeds are. Um, I won't do that good of a job of explaining what it is. So I'll just quickly say it tells your computer what to download from a website pretty much. So the two RSS feed URLs that I would look at are the section is right here RSS feeds for tags and users uh, this is what I thought was really helpful this is where you can put in a tag like for example this one is monkey or you can use a user and you would put user insert username here you would put it there so an RSS feed looks like this this is my RSS feed and you can see here this doesn't really matter because you're not going to be looking at this, but this is what an RSS feed looks like. So it has the description, it has the video, and it has the keywords and stuff like that. It has every single video. So what you're going to want to do now that you have an RSS feed is now you're going to need to download an RSS feed viewer or reader or whatever you want to call it. The one that I suggest getting is called Miro. So go ahead and type that in. It's getmiro.com, and then just hit the download Miro free button. And you can see here, it can play any video file, uh, more HD than anyone, thousands of channels, save YouTube videos, etc. So hit download Miro free, and then install it like you normally would. Once Miro is fully installed and ready to run, go ahead and open it up. And you'll get a screen similar to this, and hit channels add channel or apple enter control n depending on what computer you're on and then paste the rss feed here and the rss feed is um uh it mine is like this if you go back to the youtube slash rss ls it says uh www.youtube.com slash rss slash tag slash and it gives monkey as an example you'd put the tag that you want there dot rss that would be the url of that one and then for this it's uh the same slash rss slash user slash uh whatever the username is so mine is baseball is better and you can track anyone's it doesn't have to be yours so you can track mine i can track yours or anything like that uh once you have the url paste it in here and then hit okay i've already done this so i'm just going to hit cancel and then you will have um, a channel kind of thing right here. Um, it, it'll look somewhat like this, and you can watch it right through here, which is pretty nice. Uh, if you don't want to watch it through here, it's saved to a file on your computer. Um, you can go there by hitting Preferences, and it's under the Download section right here. Mine is here. Um, movies Miro. So here I can even show you. If I just go to Finder, open up a new one, Adam Movies Miro. And then it'll have this is uh, the one that I made. And you'll see here this is uh, the latest, the latest video. And you can watch it straight through here. Thank you for watching and please visit my website at howtoforcomputers.com. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and while you're there, check out a couple of my other videos. Thank you.